Barbara Bossen. American actress, Barbara Bossen, died on February 18, at age 83. She was most known for her role, as Faye Furillo, in 103 episodes, of the TV series, Hill Street Blues. She was nominated for five Primetime Emmy Awards, for this role. Barbara has appeared in dozens of television series, including Hooperman, Cop Rock, and Murder One. On the big screen, she appeared in films, such as The Last Starfighter, and Calendar Girl Murders. Richard Belzer. Richard Belzer, the beloved comedian who began as an edgy stand-up performer before finding further fame as the cynical but stalwart detective John Munch on Homicide, Life on the Street and Law and Order, Special Victims Unit, has died. He was 78. Paco Rabanne. Paco Rabanne was a fashion designer known for his space-age designs in unusual materials, such as metal and plastic died, February 3, 2023, died at his home in France at the age of 88. Stella Stevens. Stevens worked alongside Bing Crosby in Elvis Presley, and won a Golden Globe for her role in 1959's Say One For Me. Stella Stevens, an actor well known for her roles in several 1960s and 70s films, has died at age 84. Her son, actor Andrew Stevens, confirmed to the outlet the cause of death was Alzheimer's disease. Cody Longo. Cody Longo, an actor known for his roles in the television series, Hollywood Heights, and Days of Our Lives, was found dead on Wednesday at his home in Austin, Texas. He was 34. He died in his sleep, likely from accidental alcohol poisoning, his representative, Alex Gittleson. Charlie Thomas. Charlie Thomas was a tenor singer with the Drifters, known for doo-wop hits including, Under the Boardwalk, and, Save the Last Dance for Me. Died, January 31, 2023 Died at his home in Bowie, Maryland of liver cancer at the age of 85. Melinda Dillon. American actress, Melinda Dillon, passed away at age 83. She died on January 9, but it became known about it only a few weeks ago. She was most known for her roles in films, such as Harry and the Hendersons. A Christmas Story, Magnolia, and The Prince of Tides. Melinda was twice nominated for an Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress, for her roles, in Close Encounters of the Third Kind, and in No Malice. Her last major role, was as Ginger Templeman, in the 2007 film, Power Over Me.